I don't know. Do you let me pass? Or do you not let me pass? Morning all. Sunday run time. I did have <laughs> an easy eight mile planned out. And within a mile, I've already deviated, gone through a load of woods, and now running across a big open field. It's good to change your mind sometimes. Just make it a bit more fun. So today's run is an eight miler, or thereabouts anyway. Maybe a bit more, maybe a bit less. Who cares? Um, it's cold. There was a wee bit of wind out before, which made it pretty chilly with the wind. It's about minus two temperature wise. And to be honest, I'm getting a bit over running in the snow. <laughs> It'd be nice to just have a run on a trail with no snow. So with this eight mile run, uh, this is bringing up my mileage nicely for the year. So I've started off really slowly, uh, just due to last year, the last six months uh, struggling with some injuries. So I've made sure this year I started off easy and building three weeks in mileage. So three weeks, one week after the other, a bit more mileage and time on feet. Then the next week, drop it down, have an easier week, and then repeat and build up the mileage again. And that seems to be going quite well uh, so far this year. It is a slower start than I'd normally have for a year, but I am feeling okay. And the injuries, oh, there's no wood. Let me touch some wood. The injuries seem to be at bay. There's this big open belt on the left. No trees about. Wind's coming in. Flaming freezing with the wind. Awesome. So the forecast for this week isn't amazing. So I think it's going to be fairly low clouds, cold, cold temperatures, maybe a bit of wind and snow. So I doubt I'm going to go anywhere high. So yeah, I'm unsure as to what sort of footage I can bring you this week. I do like to get somewhere a bit spectacular. You might have to settle for lower down this week. We'll see how it goes. This is pretty tough going. There's no path where I am. Just sinking snow. But nice to run along the river. Here's my bench. <laughs> so it's Monday today. Uh, after yesterday's run, I just I felt a little twinge in my leg. So today I'm not gonna go for a run. Just gonna do some stuff in the cave, done some stuff on YouTube and having a walk on the treadmill. And hopefully it'll just feel fine tomorrow. Best just listening to your, your body though. It's quite a nice day, which is a shame I didn't actually go out. But maybe I take a day or two off earlier in the week. Um, usually I do that later in the week, but we'll see how it goes. 
So at the moment, just watching some Netflix. Uh, what you guys watching on Netflix at the moment? I've just finished watching a detective program, program called Unforgotten. Uh, that was really good. So I recommend that one to anyone out there. So give us your suggestions. So just heading out, uh, what day are we on? Uh, Tuesday. Just heading out for a short run. Uh, weather's nice, nice blue skies. Minus 10 at the moment. So it's gonna be chilly. So I'm gonna be wrapped up. I'm gonna film this one uh, as a time warp. So I'm gonna put the GoPro on a, a strap, stick the strap to my head, a bit like that, and just film it, see what happens. Hopefully the battery lasts. It's not gonna be a very long run, so it should last. But in the cold, Batteries just can die in a second. So I might take a spare battery, but I doubt I'm gonna look at the camera whilst I'm running, because it's gonna be in my head. So if it's a, a full time warp of the run, great. If it cuts short at some point, it's because it was cold. Okay, let's get going. worked out really well I just checked the footage and yeah it looks really good so that was basically set on time warp uh, setting at 15 speed so it's a three mile run enjoyed that leg felt okay lovely day uh, I was wearing quite a lot because I thought it'd be really cold but I warmed up pretty quickly so now I'm roasting <laughs> see you tomorrow Morning all, so it's Wednesday, uh, Wednesday run, I'm going to run up the ski road uh, which is closed to traffic, there's a big closed sign there, current temperature is minus ten and a half and it's only going to get colder as I go higher up, so it's going to be a bit of a chilly one this. I was wondering what footwear to wear, I have brought a couple of different options, I think I'm going to go with the Arctic Claws. I thought the ski road would have been a little less snow and ice on it. Uh, it hasn't really snowed for a while, uh, but it's been really cold. So it's just turned to bulletproof ice. So I've got Catoolas in case I need them, but I'll start off with my Arctic Claws. Okay, let's get going. I'm only a, a mile in and man it's cold. <laughs> Don't know how cold but I'm wearing big thick ski mitts and I still can't feel my fingers in either of my hands. So I'm just trying to go at such a speed 
whereas I'm not going to sweat too much. Lovely day for it. Oh. This is a little bizarre. I'm running, running up the ski road. The snow is getting heavier, so it's hard to run. And I'm actually chasing a herd of reindeer. Who, funnily enough, are moving <laughs> easier than me. Look, reindeer poo. Ah, oh, because I'm talking. They've run ahead. I might stop talking. See if we can catch them. Hello. That's me, top of Cairngorm, or top of Cairngorm, um, to, the, to the base station, where they're normally to the ski, and uh, this is the car park. And this, normally, when it's like this, lovely snow conditions, Normally you can't even park, there's so many cars here. Covid means I've got it virtually to myself. A few other skiers come up. Rory the Peasty Basher is doing his Peasty machine. But I am going to head back down. It will be, I don't know, about a five and a half mile run in the end. Lovely day. Hey, awesome. Just your average everyday run outside, this is. There's reindeer coming, so I'm going to keep my voice down and see if I get him on camera. No, he wasn't having it. He's turned around and gone the other way. <laughs> Yet another gorgeous morning out on the trails, or actually on a road. <laughs> yeah, I'm classing, classing this as a road run. <laughs> Just have to be careful going down, because as I'm going down, the snow's not as thick, and it's getting icier in patches. So I just need to be careful not to slip. But, whew, warmed up, so I was freezing cold up until about a mile, mile and a half. But then, just because you're going uphill and working, I warmed up. So, just right. Got a little bit of a sweat on, but nothing too bad. I should have been careful here. Getting slippier. Let's get going down the hill. That's it, end of the run. Back to the car, 5.7 miles. Absolutely loved it. Great fun.